हेलो फ्रेंड्स यू आर मोस्ट वेलकम इन माय यूट्यूब चैनल एविएशन जगत टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट डीएमई डीएमई स्टैंड फॉर डिस्टेंस मेजरिंग इक्विपमेंट देयर आर मेनी इंपॉर्टेंट टर्म्स इन डीएमई इज दैट वी आर डीएमई आई एस डीएमई एंड लोकलाइजर डीएमई आई नो दैट फ्यू क्वेश्चन आर कमिंग इन योर माइंड फ्रॉम दिस टॉपिक इज दैट वाट इज डीएमई हुई टाइप एंटीना यूज इन डीएमई लोकेशन ऑफ डीएमई एंटीना एंड हाउ इट कैलकुलेट द डिस्टेंस फ्रॉम द एयरक्राफ्ट सेवर टू द डीएमई स्टेशन so friends let's start video but before starting video if you are new on my youtube channel then please subscribe my channel a dme system calculate the distance from the aircraft to the dme ground station and display it on the flight deck it can also display calculated air speed and elapsed time for arrival when the aircraft is traveling to the station a dme is most important for the aircraft because a pilot can positively identify the location of the aircraft dme operates in the uche frequency range from 962 megahertz to 1213 megahertz now second and most important question is that which type antenna used for the transmitting and receiving signal of the dme here we use a blade type antenna mounted to the underside of the fuse large center line now we will discuss about how a DM antenna can identify the location of the aircraft in respect to the ground DM station before this we have to know that DM system consists of a DM transceiver display and antenna as well as the ground based DM unit and its antenna a carrier signal transmitted from the aircraft is modulated with a string of integration pulses the ground unit receive the pulses and return a signal to the aircraft its meaning is that from aircraft transmitter a carrier wave signal is transmitted to the ground dme station and then ground dme station receive that pulses and return that signal to the aircraft the total time of sending a signal and receiving a signal is converted into nautical mile for display with the help of this nautical mile we can identify that within how much time we will reach the ground station and also speed of aircraft calculated and displayed a traditional dme display the distance from the dme transmitter antenna to the aircraft this is called slight distance it is very accurate here dme display the distance from the aircraft to the dme station not distance from the aircraft to the ground but now some modern dme are equipped to calculate the ground distance from the aircraft and display it in the dme display or ehsi eadi or in efis now we will discuss some important term of the dme like that vor dme ils dme or localizer dme vor dme the dme frequency is paired to the correlated vor frequency when the correct frequency is tuned for the vor signal the dme is tuned automatically and then it will tell the location of the aircraft from the ground vor transmitter and also it will tell the distance of the aircraft from the ground transmitter vor now second one is ils dme in instrument landing system we have to know the location of the aircraft and how much distance needed for reaching in the outer marker middle marker or in inner marker with the help of dme and marker we can identify the distance of the aircraft from the ground station so i hope that you understood all about our dme thank you friends for watching my video if you are new on my youtube channel then please subscribe and support my video 